Welcome all you arithmetic ninjas to question number 19. Three quarters of a thousand. Now then, easiest way to do this is probably just to draw a bar to represent 1000. Okay? Now, if the whole bar represents 1000, and we are trying to split it into quarters, each of the four squares would be a quarter. Now, if you split it in half, that would be 500 in each half because two lots of 500 makes a thousand but if two of the squares are worth 500 you need to split those in half again to get a quarter so you need to split 500 in half now if you can do that in your head that's great you should be getting 250 so in this 500 split in half is also 250 each you can't split 500 in half in your head you could do a quick bush shelter split it in half is divided by two so 2's into 5 goes 2 remainder 1, 2's into 10 goes 5 times, and 2's into 0 goes none. So that's why it's 250. But now what you need to realise is that we're actually looking for 3 quarters. This square is just 1 quarter. So 1 quarter is 250, 2 quarters is 2 lots of 250, 3 quarters is 3 lots of 250. So we basically need 3 lots of 250. 3 lots of 250 is... 3 times 0 is 0, 3 times 5 is 15, put the 5 in, carry the 1, 3 to use is 6, plus the 1 is 7, 750. Final answer is 750. You could also just say, well, these two together make 500, so it's 500 plus 1 extra lot of 250, and 500 plus 250 is also another way of getting 750.